Do you think I can wear my reindeer antlers or they'll hit all the stalactites? Or Which stalactite. ones are on the top? I just told Maybe you. the girls want their new hats. I don't get that wrong. Yeah, all give right. them their new hat. Do you think they'll fit? Uh, it might be like a good um, uh, like indicator so you know you don't bunk your head. Like you'll hit your antlers first. I did hit my head in the cave in Ohio. Did you have reindeer antlers on? No. Uh -uh. Okay. Good morning. You been sleeping? What? Are you tired? It's like 9 o'clock a.m. Sunday after Thanksgiving and we stopped to go check out some caves. So we're at Crystal Cave. It says it's discovered 1871. Uh, it was just off the turnpike so we're gonna go check it out quick before we keep going home. Max was getting a little crazy. I think everybody wants want to stretch their legs out of it. So we're gonna go check it out. Emma has her new elf taking him into the cave. What's his name? Present. Present. We're taking present into the cave. If I want ice cream, it's 25 degrees out. No, thank you. You don't want ice cream? It's 25 degrees Yeah, it just means it won't melt as fast. Well, still out and get frozen cold and then turn into an ice cube. Couple things before we enter. Um, Discovered by accident, I think we found it out. The farmers here uh, lived out where we bought your tickets. That was the farmhouse, the Myrtle Farm. And using limestone in the spring to go in with their crops, this is the hillside of plastic. And when they did so, they were pulling away the debris, they find an opening. So that's 1871. Come on, let's go in. Look at this, it looks like ice, doesn't it look like ice? I know. I know. Don't worry, I won't bump my head. If I do, I'll survive. All right, the original tours would have gone up there. We've gone the opposite way that we built it today. When we exit, when we come down this ramp, you'll find out why. The guides have good journals and they pass those along to us, and we give you a lot of information that, that they had. Um, we would have pointed some things out to you along the way, but this would have been the first major feature you would have seen. They name things according to what it looked like, not geologically what it was. So, would you be surprised to see a plate of ice cream? <laughs> That's what they call it, the frozen fountain. So you had a two foot tall plate of ice cream, okay? We just updated it. Now we got an upside down ice cream cone, okay? Every name in the cave, everything that they turned at that time, I can tell you that uh, I feel comfortable in saying we're likely going to get out of here if an earthquake would occur. <laughs> I've been in here when they occurred. Ooh. Ooh. We've had That's called profile rock. Who was the 16th president of the United States? Rick. And you see him? Because they did. Here's his nose. Oh, wow. oh his yeah. There's the mouth. And up here is the forehead. His hair is disheveled. I've never seen Lincoln have hair that looks like he ever ran a phone through it. But they did see Abraham Lincoln. One, 45 feet. Good, sweetie. From the bottom of the gear, now this is up, we're about 80 feet from the top of the hill. If you turn around on the back, that's the walkway. That's how you really got up here. So just imagine what you were wearing tied together. Put the ladder there. down so you're bridging the gap between places where it fell. You've got only one hand because you're holding your light. And you were smart enough to wear the best clothes you had, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's how you took the tour. That's how you took the tour. Where you are now, they eventually put in a wooden platform. It didn't take too long. But all the way back to my pointer is against the wall. There used to be a spring underneath us, actually flowing, recorded, that there were insects and other living things in them without light. Even though they had eyes, they were blind, okay? But farming, the water table was dropped. So there's no other water, there's no permanent body of water in Crystal Cave. It gets wet. But down below there's two 
two heads, but they're looking at each other. One here, one there. Matter of fact, looks like two people sitting down with arms and legs held together like they're sharing a secret. Down below that, looks like something Native American. The face is going to the left. Below that, a dragon. Some see Homer Simpson. See that? <laughs> Pick that up too. And then down below that, there's a skull. Well, we call this the totem pole. But the bridge is wet. That's the spot I was talking about. So it could be slippery. Girls touching. Okay. So, what does it feel like? Touching the fried What does it feel like? These are fried eggs. Oh, look, there's the yolk. And there's the white part. No, it looks like an egg Look, this looks like an egg shell, like the egg cracked. A little hard to see in the camera, but... It did leave us with a mystery. Or somebody did. Because it says, it really looks like C-H-E-S-T. -E Chest. It really looks like that. Now we're a small group here. If by some stroke of luck, we find the treasure chest. <laughs> but we found things inside the cave. Unfortunately for you, the small museum that we have, the artifacts left behind, that you can't get to see. There definitely wasn't a chest or anything like that. So we don't know what that is. With the exception, a few years ago, I had somebody on the tour that claimed to be a relative to one of these two boys that said there weren't two, there were three. So, oh. I've never met, yeah, i never met <laughs> I know uh, this would be a show of Gunsmoke at one point, and there was a Chester on that. I, I know Chester was a name, he had no name. We don't know what that means. Okay. Did you know you were going to the zoo today? That's what I thought. You're giving me the money. My wife does that every time I say, I have no money. Okay. If you look up here, because in front of that seal, we have a three hump panel. Okay. Lying down. And here you can see the body, here's the head. Ah, he looks like he looks forward. But his left eye, on a log, you see what appears to be a beaver or an otter. He's actually watching his feet. Or a three legged turtle. Who is just <laughs> captured by this lizard head down beneath the rock here. You can see his body and his tail, you can see his legs. Everybody thinks he's shy. That's why he's scared because where these kids carve their name, it turns out to be the face of an alligator. Okay, you can see the eyes and you can see aren't the feet there. There's the nose, there's the mouth, and there's the mane. You see it? So throughout the cave, change the distance, change the angle, change the lighting, change the shadow, then the screw disappear. Oh, yeah. The wishing well. Oh, hi. I'm going to get a shot. Again, fell asleep. In the cave. I mean, it's dark and warmer than outside, at least. Yeah. He's got his mama snug in him. Well, he said he wanted mama. Extra careful now. Look at Cece jumping steps here. This is so cool. It is. <laughs> what do you girls think? Are you glad we stopped? This is way cooler than the day we went to in Ohio. That was like nothing compared to. Like right now we're on top of the mountain and we're just inside. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's so cool. It's cool, right? In fact, yeah, there's some of those rocks, the formation right up there. Yeah. And just over there. So Emma liked oh, it. Oh, it's easy. So it was cool. Max? Max felt like... Max, <laughs> Max did not like when they shut the lights off at all. So I got... I, I didn't really. I, like, I felt like if I moved my foot one inch the wrong way, I'd fall. A frozen praying, praying mantis. mantis. Oh, it's dead. Because it's frozen. It's too cold. Why is it supposed to come out? Not, not, spring, not, yeah. not winter, not in November. Almost like December 1st. <laughs> well, it was snowing today. Uh, yeah. So I don't know about that bug maybe needed to be someplace warmer. It is almost December. Yeah. It just has to go very deep in the cave. Well, look, they have, they have the sleuth. Is that what it's called? Sleuth? Sleuth. Sleuth. I always say sleuth like uh, a detective. Yeah. 
kind of like a detective. You're hunting for the rocks. Well, that's what I said, but I kept messing it up. Sluice. Sluice the stuff out of there. I'll have to remember it like you get the stuff loose in the sluice. Tracy, how'd you go so fast? So she's got to pee, that's why. <laughs> it's lower but she might be sleeping. Cecilia told us when we were at the very end or the deepest part of the cave that she had to use the bathroom. <laughs> said, I had to use the bathroom. Yeah. Try to make her own stalagmites. <laughs> Grandpa Joe. Yeah, so Cecilia had to use the bathroom. Now she's running down the hill to get back to the bathroom. And we're heading down. But I thought it was pretty cool. That was the first time I was in an, like a cave cave. The one we went to in Ohio, like Mama said, that was a, that was cool to be in a big hole, but it wasn't nothing like this. I'm sorry. Why you out, out of breath? breath? It might be shaking a little bit. Uh, it's a big mountain and I carried my 20 pound baby now. Okay guys, so we're back in the motorhome. We checked out the cave, the cave was cool. Emma liked it. Cecilia's in the bathroom. Yeah, the bathroom. <laughs> she ran. But we're still like, what, three hours from home. And you said I could go to QVC. Yep, we have to stop at QVC. Because it was 35 minutes. Yeah. For Grandma. Love home shopping. Yep. So. Except Grandpa. <laughs> well, Grandpa's wallet, maybe. Maybe you'll see that in our next video. QVC. What can't you buy there? Okay guys, I hope you like this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the thumbs up, right on. Okay. See you guys next time. Bye.